I've been kidnapped. Yeah. You see where we are? No. Now what the hell is going on? I ain't rightly sure. But you've got some theories. So working it through. I don't want you to spare me, Mal. If you think you know what's happening, then you tell me. You wouldn't spare Zoe if she were in this situation with you, would you? You would be planning and plotting and possibly scheming. So whatever Zoe would do in this instance is what I want to do. And you know why? Because no matter how ugly it gets, you two always come back with the stories. So I'm Zoe. Now, what do I do? Probably not talk quite so much. Right, less talking. She's terse. I can be terse. Once in flight school, I was laconic. If I'm not going to talk, then you have to. What else? We just got to keep our heads. Right, keep our heads. That way we'll be able to, you know, keep our heads. You and Zoe have been in plenty of situations like this before, right? Many a time. Many a time, you and Zoe. Once we know who it was took us. Zoe and you, together in a tricky... Mal, she's my wife! Huh? What gives you the right to put her in a dangerous situation like this? I didn't. You did! She ain't here, Wash. No, but she would have been. Okay. I mean, I'm the one that she swore to love, honor, and obey. Listen, she swore to obey? Well, no, not. But that's just my point. You, she obeys. She obeys you. There's obeying going on right under my nose. Look, Zoe and I have a history. She trusts me. What's that supposed to mean? Don't mean a thing, but you're making out like she blindly follows my every word. That ain't true. Sure it is. Not so. There's plenty of orders of mine that she didn't obey. Name what? She married you! Meta mother. Undone. What? 